Hi, I'm Steve. And I'm Brian. And joining us behind the scenes is our friend Eric. Hello everyone. We're the Hobby Farm Guys. And today we're going to discuss what can chickens do for you on your hobby farm. Stay tuned. If you have a hobby farm or are thinking about having a hobby farm, then chances are you've thought about chickens. That's because chickens are one of the easiest things to start with on a hobby farm. It doesn't matter if you have a large place or just a small backyard, most everyone uh, can find the room for a few chickens. Yeah, not only is it relatively easy, but there's a lot of benefits to having chickens on your farm. Uh, we've put together a list of some of those positives and we hope this helps you. The first and most obvious benefit to keeping chickens is they provide you with food. Yeah. A lot of us, you know, farm fresh eggs is synonymous with hobby farms. Uh, a lot of these chickens can provide, you know, five, six eggs a week. Yeah, and if eggs aren't your thing, uh, who doesn't like chicken, right? Fried, barbecued, roasted, uh, whatever your preference, it's another great benefit to having chickens on your farm. Absolutely. Now keep in mind, uh, there are different varieties of chickens. Some of them are bred specifically for meat, some of them specifically uh, geared towards egg production, but there's also a, a wide variety of what we call dual purpose birds uh, that are going to provide both meat and eggs for your hobby farm. Yeah, and one thing to consider though is that whether it's eggs or meat, as a hobby farmer there's a good chance that you're not going to be able to raise your own eggs or raise your own chickens cheaper than you could get them at the grocery store. But the difference is when you raise your own, you know exactly what's gone into your food. Absolutely. So a second benefit to raising chickens in your hobby farm uh, is earning a little bit of money. Uh, just like you can raise eggs and, and meat for you and your family, you can sell those things to other people. Now bear in mind that just like you can sometimes buy them cheaper in the store than you can raise them, so can your neighbors. Yeah. So. Uh, be aware of that when you plan for that revenue stream. Recognize that you've got to set your eggs and, and meat apart uh, from the, what's in the grocery store and from other people in the area. Yeah, and another revenue stream that's possible is to hatch and sell chicks. Um, small farms, hobbyists in your area, uh, they're looking to buy chicks as well. And if you're the one selling them, why not buy them from you? Next on our list of things chickens can do for you, free labor. Ah, two of my favorite words. Yep, chickens love bugs. Chickens can take care of a bug problem in quick order. Uh, they will eat those things throughout the day uh, while they're out there scratching around. And that will reduce the bug population in your yard and garden and orchard and help out with those things as well. Yeah, and while they're in your garden, they might do some weeding too. Uh, a lot of the weeds chickens like to eat, but you gotta be careful. They also like to eat some of the crops, so at certain times of the year and certain places in your garden, you're going to have to restrict access for the chickens. Yep. Uh, the other thing that we can get from chickens is fertilizer. Chickens are a great source of fertilizer, although it will need to be composted first when you clean up the coop. Uh, they're also doing that throughout the day as they wander around, dropping that. Mm -hmm. um, one of the things that we like to do at our farm is we actually turn the chickens in and let the chickens turn the compost pile for us. Yeah. They go out there and they scratch and they pick through and get little bits. Uh, While well, the whole time they're adding additional uh, nitrogen into the mix. Yeah, and you can throw your scrap food to the chickens. They'll eat some of it and what's left over just goes in the compost pile with everything else. Yep, just be careful not to give them anything they shouldn't have. Yeah, definitely. Now the last item on our list of things that chickens can do for you is probably my favorite. They can just give you hours of enjoyment. This is more of an intangible benefit. Yeah. Right? But there is something very soothing, relaxing, of being able to just look out that window and, and see those birds out in the, the yard kind of clucking around and scratching in the dirt, uh, knowing that you're going to go get some eggs a little bit later on. Yeah. Uh, just enjoy looking out and seeing those chickens. Yeah, and a lot of people keep chickens as pets too. Some of them are really great birds for pets. Uh, like you, I just enjoy having that mixed flock out in the yard, seeing all the different colors and patterns of birds strutting around, just being chickens. Yep, right until it's uh, about 20 below and you have to go out and give them water, right? <laughs> yeah, that's right. So that's our list of things chickens can do for you on your hobby farm. Yeah, to recap, uh, they can provide you with eggs and meat, so food for you and your family. Uh, you can earn some money selling that meat or eggs or even hatching and selling chicks. Uh, they can do labor for you, whether it's eating bugs or weeding your garden or making fertilizer for you. 
And finally, it's just the enjoyment that you get out of having chickens, whether keeping them as pets or, or just watching them out in the yard. Yeah. Let us know what you think of that list. Also, if there's a benefit to chickens that you found that we didn't mention, let us know in the comment section. Yeah. Is there a particular breed I should get if I want some? Oh, good question, Eric. Uh, next week, we're actually going to talk about the best laying hens for your hobby farm. Till then, thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Hey everybody, I'm Brian from the Hobby Farm Guys. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and click that like button. Uh, subscribe to us. We post videos every Thursday if you'd like to see more. And leave comments down below. Thanks.